Helen the Ship here, and today we're going to make twice baked potatoes in the microwave. And this is a really nice hearty snack, or it can work for a lunch too. So you can follow along and make this with me, or make it later when you get a chance. All right, so let's take a look at the ingredients we're going to put into this twice baked potato. Of course, we have a potato, and potato is, of course, a vegetable. But potato is kind of a special vegetable because it has a lot of carbohydrates and it's actually a nutrient dense carbohydrate. It has a lot of vitamins and minerals and fiber and especially in the skin. So potatoes are especially high in vitamin C, vitamin B6, and then they have the minerals potassium, more potassium than a banana even, and manganese, one of the small minerals that we need. Then we're going to add some veggies to our potato. And so today I've got some spinach, and I'm going to put in some pepper, a little bit of this scallion or chive, and some broccoli. Of course, more veggies. So, so far we have a lot of veggies. And then we're going to add some cheese, and we're going to put in some plain yogurt. You could also use sour cream, but I like plain yogurt better. It's healthier. And those are in dairy, of course, right? And then we just are going to add um, a little bit of salt and pepper if we want, or you could use some garlic powder or maybe some seasoning salt. And that's about it. So what else do we need to make this snack? A plate, a bowl, a fork and a spoon, a knife and, and possibly some scissors for chopping, a couple of measuring cups. We need a half cup and a tablespoon. Of course, we need a microwave and we need some pot holders because this potato is going to get very hot in that microwave. First thing we have to do is wash our hands. So we're going to get our hands wet, grab soap, suds up, and wash for the time it takes to sing happy birthday twice, and then rinse. The second thing we have to do is wash our fruits and vegetables. We started by microwaving our potato the first time. So in this recipe, we actually microwave the potato twice. The first time, it's just a plain potato. So we're going to poke some holes in it to let the steam out, and the fork works well for this. And then we're going to put it in the microwave for two minutes, and then we're going to turn it over, let's put some holes on this side too, and we're going to microwave it for another two minutes. And hopefully that will cook our potato completely. The length of time depends a lot on the size of your potato and the strength of your microwave, so you'll have to just see if it's soft after that time. So let's go put it in the microwave. Okay, I microwaved the potato two minutes on one side and two minutes on another. Let's see if it's done. I think mine is not quite soft enough. I think I'll put it on for another minute. So while the potato is in the microwave, we can get started chopping our veggies. We need about a half a cup of veggies for our potato. So let's use some of this spinach. The scissors work really well for this spinach. This is spinach that I just picked from the garden. I'm going to use a little bit of, the, of this tiny little scallion or some chives would be nice. And look, this, the scissors look, work really well for this too. Broccoli is really nice with these. So let me cut off just a little bit. We don't need much. And it's better if we chop this pretty finely so that it actually cooks in the microwave. And it looks like we have a little teeny bit of space for some of the green pepper. I'm just going to cut off a little slice of this green pepper. Okay, we have our veggies already. Let's check on our potato. I put it in for another minute. So now it's been two, four, five minutes total. And I think that feels softer. So our next step is to cut the potato in half and we're gonna cut it lengthwise. It's really hot, watch out. And then we're gonna actually let it cool off a little bit. Now we get to scoop out the potato. We wanna leave the skin intact and put the potato into the bowl leave your potato skin there because we're going to put the potato back in there. I'm going to leave some potato on my skin so it kind of stays intact. We dump in our veggies. We're going to put in about two tablespoons of plain yogurt and then we can add a little tiny sprinkle of salt and pepper. You can add your garlic powder now if you want to and then what we do is mash it up with this fork make it nice and creamy. What other veggies would be good in this dish? What about cauliflower or finely chopped carrots? Hmm, you could add zucchini. You could really add a lot of different veggies. 
Now what we do is we scoop it back into our potato. Okay, the potatoes are stuffed. Now we just take about a tablespoon of our shredded cheese. I'm gonna sprinkle that on top. And now we microwave it for one more minute. Let's see how they look. Don't forget the pot holders, it's gonna be hot. Great, our twice baked potatoes are all done and we have a delicious lunch or snack. I hope you get a chance to try this sometime soon. Bye.